Ladies and gentlemen, we are back with some more Batman the Telltale series. We are currently in episode 2, The Children of Arkham. Last time we left off, we had to deal with Vicky being a snoop. The snoopy reporter that she is. We got to talk to Falcone. Figured out that our parents were assassinated. And apparently, someone drugged Sergeant Renee Montoya. Let's get started. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with a friend. Damn, that's a nice car. Either Cobblepot drug Montoya himself, or someone else is using his revolutionary rhetoric. Either way, I need to find him. Let's put our drones in the air and start a search. I'll run a trace on his cell. In the meantime, we have to find out what we can do about this drug. The computer's been analyzing the chemicals from Montoya's bloodstream. Throw that up on the monitor. The residue I scan on Montoya is similar to the nerve agent I found at the docks. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Falcone died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. Who'd have guessed that's how he'd meet his maker? Prone in his sickbed, surrounded by police who were ordered to protect him. Murder at the hands of Montoya. That's not justice. Whoever did this was judge, jury, and executioner. No one should act as all three. I hope he told you something before he was killed. Technically, it was only judge and jury, not executioner. What did you learn from him? Uh, Practically family. family, he said. Family? Funny, I don't recall any Sunday dinners with the mob. It wasn't Falcone who called the hit. Yes, well, I suppose that makes sense. Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. Computers pinpointed reference points on the two compounds. There's only two people. Out of the three men, Hill, Falcone, and Thomas, only one of them's alive. So, process elimination. Pretty sure Hill did it. The men at the docks were doused with the base chemicals. The reaction was messy. They were out of control. So I'm gonna guess the Montoya sample is a more controlled dose. This refined drug is like a weapon. It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters and make her act on her base impulses. Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of such a drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars is one thing, but dragging others to fight them for you... Oh. With this drug, they can exploit anyone's baser impulses, the things they would otherwise control. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot's location. All right, Cobblepot, where are you at? I only have one drone scouring an entire city. Oh, I have three jumps. Alright, let's see. Go farther away. Nope. Alright, so if it's not over here, it has to be. Bring 
gonna match. And don't you go to be right. Right. Skyline Club. The Skyline Club. Jesus, didn't even wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce? Bruce Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. Batman ain't gonna take shit from nobody. a boy, Batman. Touching and listening thing. Come on, come on, I know there's gotta be more around here. A man probably had millions in his sock drawer. Who's if, that guy in the back? Out, I hope you. He'll kill me. Of course, won't be doing much of anything. Ever again. Who's that guy supposed to be? The green, blue, gray. Him out. You lot, come check out this office. Where is oh, oh, you can help me? <laughs> Let him go. Batman! It's about time. You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. But don't worry, I'll pass your gratitude on to those who made it happen. They'll be pleased to know you think so highly of their work. I said let him go. You hear that, Rowling? That sounded like an order. I'll crush him. Now, now, have a little respect for the bat. Think he underestimates you. Is this about Falcone? We all saw how you felt about Falcone. Pounded him into a pulp on live TV. If you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself. Admit it, Falcone deserved to die. Vermin nope. like Falcone, they deserve to be stomped out. Believe me, I know from personal experience. I don't kill my enemies. Maybe that's why you got so many. Might be time to reconsider. He's not As wrong. a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. How's about we talk this through? We helped you with Falcone. Now, if we could just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill, ordinary folks might be able to breathe. Uh, I'll deal with What them. is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? You're going to attack the mayor? That's not going to happen. Attack? Absolutely not. Mayor Hill's role has been decided. Here's the thing. I actually admire you, Batman. We both want the same kinds of things. Me and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. They found Catwoman. What do you want with her? We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. So sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay to watch. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Or what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name. <laughs> Hiya! Oh no. Damn, he's strong. I swear I press circle. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Hiya! 
gonna oh. have to try harder than this. What is this guy made no. of? <laughs> Grappling hook! Jeez, he disappears faster than Batman. Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. A big fan. Already halfway through this episode, guys. But we're making much better time than we did last episode. But in order to get to 2.3, to what, like, four parts? Yeah, already there, and it's only part two. But seriously, who the hell is that guy? Welcome to the ghetto of Gotham, ladies and gents. Six p.m. No cares. Uh, what if I want to wear a suit? Didn't clarify about that. Also, that looks super shady. A rich dude in a dump. <gasps> Wait, he didn't look about at the lost cat poster. No. Well, cat lives matter, Batman. I just want to bet Selena stole the cats. Stacked deck. 6:26 p.m. twist in the race for the mayor's office as Harvey Dent backer Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Mr. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as, well, a jealous sort. Very possessive of his toys. Better keep a low profile. Let's get a drink here. You lost? Because I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. Flash some cash. Flash money like that in here, you better be ready to fight. I got customers who knife a man for less. Selena Kyle, where is she? Hey, don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. The cops take all your fancy clothes? Who are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Uh, buy you a drink? How about a few? <laughs> it ain't like you're short on cash. Fuck. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. Her you were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Oh, never mind. There Instead, you just pissed him off. Well, I've met a couple of his goons myself. Your client isn't one for subtlety. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. Uh -huh. The penguin. <laughs> it's not my fault that you're in this, Selena, but I can help you out of it. Tell me what you know about Penguin. She doesn't I only want know to be my reputation. cuddled. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. We grew up together. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. 
Why leave that? He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Yep. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. You let people Whatever die. Whatever Penguin is planning, innocent people will end up in the line of fire. Innocence. Not me. Bruce. Sweetie. The gallant knight thing. It really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us? Working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. Thought you were you dating. and Harvey, it's pretty clear you aren't just friends. Please. I'm just toying with him. I only take my claws out for someone special. Like you me? and I. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna happen, lady. Bar fight! Well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. Hello. Hello, Gavna. Yes, put on a dope track. Beat it. We're here for her. Uh, no, not happening. You care about your own skin? You'll get the hell out. Fuck you, motherfucker. Oh, dope punch. Pick the long, wrong duo to fight with, boy. I know Kung Fu. That was fairly easy. Oh no, a knife! I'm allergic to those. And bullets. Guns. And people saying my mom's name. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad, Brad. Uh, uh, pool table. Damn, that jacket looked nice on her. Not done yet. Guys, just stay down. I think they want more. Then let's give it to them. Oh yes, I always love one of those moves. Don't you guys just make the babies already? You fight pretty good for such a pretty boy. Uh, oh no about that. Let's see what you got? A phone? What's that? Come on, iPhone this four. Way. That thing look old. And like a piece of junk as well. Alright, come on, Selena, give me some. Give me something to work with, baby. Quick, check the alleyway! Can you see anything? Negative! Let's check the other side! Oh no, it's not like someone's hiding behind a car or anything. Are we alone? Uh, yeah, we're, we're alone. 
Let's make Yon have sex. Kiss her, I have to. Let's get out of here. Aww. Yeah, I hate. Don't you guys hate that when that happens? I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Stay out of trouble. Just. Stay out of trouble. <laughs> now, where's the fun in that? You shouldn't trust me, you know. Where did she fit that thing? Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. I'm processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? The last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. <sighs> this is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. Hill is setting me up. Penguin's gonna take a shot at me. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice. People look up to Batman after how you handle Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Hmm. Bruce Wayne. Or the Batman. Find out who I choose next time. Make sure if you guys like this video at any point in time that you like, comment, subscribe, share this video with a friend, join the clan today. I'll see you guys all later.